If you place a metal pan on the stove and turn it on, the pan gets hot. It gets hot enough to cook an egg. It gets so hot it will even burn your hand if you touch it. Heat transfer is the movement of thermal energy from one object to another. When you place the pan on the hot burner, the heat moves from the burner to the pan. When you touch the hot pan, the heat moves from the pan to your hand. Ouch. Heat can move more easily through some objects than others. Materials that transfer heat easily are called conductors. Materials that resist or block the movement of heat are called insulators. The metal pan is a good conductor. The heat from the burner can easily transfer to the pan. An oven mitt is an insulator. It blocks the heat and keeps it from moving from the pan to your hand. If you wear an oven mitt, you can touch the hot pan without getting burned. Most thermal conductors are also good electrical conductors. Metals like copper, aluminum, silver, iron, and steel are good conductors of both heat and electricity. These metals are used inside wires to create electrical circuits that carry electricity from one place to another. When you turn on a lamp, the electricity moves from the wall outlet through the metal inside the cord to the metal filament inside the light bulb. Without conductors, there would be no way to get electricity from the wall to the light bulb. Insulators are just as important as conductors. These materials help keep electrical devices safe and allow us to handle hot objects. Plastic, rubber, wood, glass, cotton, and air are all insulators. They block heat and electricity from moving from one place to another. The lamp cord and plug are both coated in plastic to keep the electrical current inside. Without this insulator, you could be electrocuted when you plug in the lamp. Thermal insulators keep hot things hot and cold things cold. Your winter coat is an insulator. It keeps your body heat from escaping. A cooler is also an insulator. When you fill it with ice, it keeps everything inside cold. This video was created by La Fontaine of Knowledge. Click the link in the description for lesson materials that go along with the video. And subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.